Bird weather with meteorologist Ted Schmidt. Ted was just telling me he has some company coming over tonight to sit on the back deck, and it should be great for that. It's perfect weather. You could not have drawn up a better day for that. Uh, anything you want to do summer-wise, we have going on right now perfect weather for that. And uh, today, a uh, top shelf day. Let me tell you, we're moving toward the weekend on a very positive note, not a cloud in the sky. A comfortable breeze, not the gusty weather we've had the past two days, and temperatures uh, very seasonable. In other words, very typical for late Summer standards, mid-August weather happening right now. It's a fine example of that as we look outside. Some hazy sunshine with our Lewiston Auto Live cameras. Temperatures now low 70s in Rochester, 71 at the airport, 73 in Albert Lee, Mesa City, 73. On our way to about 78, maybe 79 this afternoon. Bit of a south breeze, 13 miles per hour, dew point 55. Air pressure, 3003. Yes, it's a palindrome and it's holding steady right now as high pressure moves in. Now, behind that high pressure, we have a warm front draped across the plains. Once it moves through, we'll be able to tap into this type of warmth. This is what's headed our way. 87 right now in Pierce, South Dakota, Valentine, Nebraska, 86. We, on the other hand, are still mild in the 70s. A little warmer than yesterday. We barely made it to the 70s yesterday. It's 72 in Rochester today, almost there at this hour already. 71 at the airport, 73 in St. Cloud, and 73 in Green Bay. High pressure has been with us. It makes for a very very pleasant Friday. Here's that warm front to the west. It's going to come through later tonight. Temperatures will soar behind that front for the next few days. In the meantime, ahead of that, we do have some minor concerns of wildfire smoke from Canada. So some of our western and northwest counties are still in air quality alert until 11 p.m. But at this point, we are in the moderate range for air quality and likely to stay there. So not the uh, problematic orange or red range uh, at this point. So we'll stay in the range right to the weekend in that moderate si situation. Some haze visible out there. But that's about it. Uh, warm sunshine today, then it gets hot and humid tomorrow in the next few days. In fact, heat holds on right through next week until maybe next Friday as it stands right now. Here's future track, a bit of a south breeze, 10, 15, 16 miles per hour, tons of sunshine to go with it. Uh, temperatures seasonably warm, approaching the low 80s in a few spots. Tonight, a uh, breezy night after midnight. Winds pick up after midnight, 20. 30 miles per hour, and then tomorrow, breezy, warm day ahead of a weak cold front that's going to uh, bring just a few clouds, a couple spotty showers north and west of us. But for us, we'll stay dry tomorrow night into Sunday. Maybe not quite as warm Sunday behind that front as we look for temperatures in the upper 80s instead of 90. So upper 70s today, dropping to the 60s briefly tonight, and then right back to the 80s and well into the 80s. In fact, tomorrow as that heat continues to build, big dome of heat and the upper level winds, the jet stream uh, pushing way up north into Canada, allowed this, allowing this very warm air mass into the area and it's going to hang on for a week before we see some improvement. The latter part of next week we start seeing a bit of a, a change, maybe a cold front by next Friday will bring a chance uh, for something cooler, but heat next levels. Look at these 90s in the pink part of this map. Otherwise, uh, looking at 80s for highs and 90s for the next few days. In fact, the hottest of them all maybe next Wednesday. And then uh, 10 day outlook, things do get a little bit milder for the following weekend, for next weekend, 70s and low 80s, which is a little more typical for this time of the year. 79 today, mostly sunny, seasonably warm south winds at times 15 miles per hour. A little gusty late tonight with those south winds a little stronger, partly cloudy, 63. And tomorrow, a lot of sunshine, but a bit of a breeze. South winds at times gusting beyond 25 miles per hour, maybe low 30 mile per hour range. 89, it'll feel like the mid 90s, seven day forecast. Heat index levels and low and mid 90s for the entire stretch of days there and all day looking at sunshine each one of those days. No rain chances at this point for quite some time, unfortunately. No shortage of sunshine or, or heat there. Yeah, if you were hoping for one more blast of heat, if you had some plans that involve enjoying a warm summer day, you've got plenty of opportunities. Get out there. <laughs> Thank you, Ted. The man at the helm.